In this video, I'm going to teach you how to fix error code 1 in Minecraft Curse Forge. It's a very quick and easy process, so make sure to follow along. If you are using the Curse Forge launcher and you are getting this issue, game crashed exit code 1 when trying to run any mod pack, usually this happens because of mod compatibility issues. So if I close this error down and I try clicking play again, what you will notice is that I get a pop-up before this error telling me that some incompatible mods were found. Usually, this is going to be your cue to fix this error. So, if you get a window similar to this one, just read what is written here and you will be able to determine which mods are having issue. So, for example, they suggest this potential solution, install sodium version 0.5.3. Keep in mind that this potential solution is not going to be available for every single incompatibility issue. But if you see this message, just follow what is written here. Because this is going to be different for every single mod pack, I cannot give you clear instructions on what to do. You need to read the specific error that you are getting. So I'm going to attempt to do this as the potential solution listed. So what it is telling me to do is to install the sodium version. So as you can see here, I have sodium fabric version 0.5.3. What you will notice is that if I drag and drop it over here inside of the mods folder for this specific mod pack, so click the three dots, go into open folder, and then X is the mods folder, and I try running this again, I will be able to play this without any issues. So I'm gonna click play here, and you will notice that the mod pack is going to be loaded without any issues this time. So like I said, error code one usually happens because of incompatibility issues. So you need to figure out which mod is causing you trouble. If you cannot determine which mod is causing the problems, what I would recommend is to completely reinstall this mod pack. So click these little three dots, delete the profile, and then download it from scratch again. This is going to make sure that all the mods are acquired without any issues. You can also try repairing the profile if any mods were corrupted or they are having trouble being downloaded. As you can see, the window is frozen here, but after it is done loading, I'll be able to show you that the installation is now working. Now, if even after determining the compatibility issues, reinstalling or repairing the profile, it still doesn't work, then what I would recommend as a last resort is to go into a web browser and try updating Java. If you are still having trouble, right click the Windows icon on your taskbar, go over to Device Manager, and in here you will be able to find your display adapters. Right click your display adapter and then choose Update Driver. Follow through the steps on screen and you will be able to update this driver. Alternatively, if you notice that you have an NVIDIA or AMD display adapter, note down the model name and visit their website. In here, you will be able to download a specific driver for your display adapter. So for example, mine is an AMD Radeon 7900 XTX. So I simply have to go to the AMD website, select the 7000 series, 7900, and then XTX. If you have an NVIDIA GPU, just do the same, select the series, the specific model, your operating system, and then search. I hope I was able to help you on how to fix error code 1 Minecraft Curse Forge. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more quick and easy tips. Thank you for watching.